Hello everybody, and welcome back to more Bioshock. Uh, last time, what did we do? Yes, we finished up Hephaestus by making the EMP bomb, um, running around getting parts off of Big Daddy, some ionic fuel chamber things, and nitroglycerin. Uh, and then we fought our way to the Rapture Control Room, and we are on our way to, as our objectives say, kill Andrew Ryan. Yes. Um, a couple things. You, I don't know what my health and my inventory and ammo was at the end of the last video, but uh, the game crashed in the middle of saving at the end of the last recording, um, so I had to redo all of basically the last video, and I don't know what my health and everything was at, so it's probably much different because I kind of just rushed through it, but regardless, here we are. About to go kill Andrew Ryan. Let's see what we got. Oh my god, a shotgun. I haven't used my shotgun very much because I've been out of ammo for it. Even in the book of lies, sometimes you find truth. There is indeed a season for all things. And now that I see you flesh to flesh and blood to blood, I know I cannot raise my hand against you. But know this, you are my greatest disappointment. Does your master hear me? Atlas, you can kill me, but you will never have my city. My strength is not in steel and fire. That is what the parasites will never understand. A season for all things. A time to live and a time to die. A time to build. And a time to destroy! Okay, so Andrew Ryan's trying to take us down. Initial deployment, Vita Chamber. Client Ryan Industries, a stage one, need to complete. Sinclair and Alexander tried to explain the science, but the search on such a They keep saying plasmid reconstruction days and quantum entanglement and that. And then proof, dead people come back to life. Bullshit! Of course. Ryan will only allow it to be told to hear the genetic frequencies for the testing. Okay, that was a lot of story there. Um, I did make a whole bunch of stuff from the U event last uh, when I replayed this area too. So, there's something going on with Atlas, at least that's what Andrew Ryan says. Andrew Ryan thinks Atlas is using us. Um, I don't know, he did kind of just start helping us right off the bat, but he's helped us quite a bit. However, we don't really know anything about him. We know everything Aiden Ryan's done. Well, most of it. Uh, let's see. So, Andrew Ryan seems to think uh, Atlas is trying to basically steal the city from him. But as far as we're concerned, I mean, it's just trying to help us out get rid of Andrew Ryan because he's a douche. Okay. No other items around here. Man, I can't see a damn thing. It's dark. Uh, wrong button. There we go. They're giving us a lot of items. Um, I don't remember if there's actually a boss fight around here, but I'm starting to think that there might be. Thank you. 
Okay, I didn't like that. He said a phrase, though, that I don't know if any of y'all have noticed. Atlas has been saying to us most of the game. Would you kindly? That doesn't make me feel very good. Advanced deployment, Lot 111, Dr. Sucho, Flight Fontaine Futuristics. Baby is now a year old, weighs 58 pounds, and possesses gross musculature of a fit 19 year old. The results are disappointing, but within expected tolerances. We also have Would You Kindly Painted. Oh, I don't like this. Does that look familiar too? That's the picture that's been flashing at us the entire game. Something's fishy. Something's very fishy. The assassin has overcome my final defense. And now he's come to murder me. In the end, what separates a man from a slave? Money? Power? No. A man chooses. A slave obeys. You think you have memories. A father. A family. An airplane. A crash. And then this place. Was there really a family? Did that airplane crash? Or was it hijacked? Forced down. Forced down by something less than a man. Something bred to sleepwalk through life until they are activated by a simple phrase spoken by their kindly master. Was a man sent to kill, or a slave? A man chooses. A slave obeys. Come in. So... This game's older, so most people that might be watching this have already played this. <laughs> I've already played this, obviously. And I know what's going to happen, but what he says there is just, man, this game is really kind of what got me into games of deep story, and we're about to find out more, and it's, it's heavy. Stop, would you kindly? Would you kindly? Powerful phrase. Familiar phrase. Would you kindly? Would you kindly get this? Would you kindly find that? Would you kindly find that? Would you kindly find Would you kindly get this? Would you kindly head to Ryan's office and kill the son of a bitch? Sit. Would you kindly? Stand. Would you kindly? Run. Stop. Turn. A man chooses, a slave obeys. Kill! A man chooses!
so that's a lot to process. Would you kindly? Kinda seems like we're not our own person. That we are very much a slave to Atlas or to Rapture in general. But, uh, I don't want to play that. Yeah. The story just got real deep. That, that revelation right there blew my damn mind when I played this for the first time. Like I said, that's what really got me into, like, heavy story games in this game. Not that this was the first game I played with a deep story, but... Oh shit. Oh fuck me, okay. Oh, why did you s oh, oh boy. Oh man. I have to die. Get me out of here. Can I get out of here without getting just obliterated? If you know it. to go that way. As I say, if you notice, the little sisters are helping you. I don't know if they help you if you um, harvest them, but they kind of give you a lead. What a revelation, though. We've been working for Frank Fontaine the entire damn time. We're not even... Welcome back, child. Welcome to the city where you were born. You are angry at Fontaine, yes? Now you know the truth. You are his tool. Brought back to Rapture to save him. You have saved many of my little ones. I owe you a debt.
Nope. Some bullshit, man. Okay, so now he's gonna just basically try to murder us as we're escaping. I'm not going to attack them if they're not going to attack me. Oh, this music is really, really good, too. Let's hope this one doesn't get hit by a copyright claim like the other, like, four videos have. Shotgun. Oh, shit. Uh, got some armor piercing rounds, so... Telekinesis battle, though. So this is fun. Alright. As much fun as that is. Oh, shit. Uh, I don't know where to go. Okay, so there's still little sisters for me to save. buddy. Help me out. other two little sisters, and then, I don't know if that's all the little sisters in the game, but that's what we're going for right now. Hello. I'm so sorry. Ow, god, you do so a lot of damage. Hey, 
Okay, I got it. Who's there? They said you kill me! There's the little sister, though. Ah, oh, damn it. I goofed. The little sister had gone away, so I don't get the luxury of getting her this time. Damn it. Okay, that's okay. I'll just have to find another one. That's a turret. Definitely use some gene upgrades, but I have no Adam. Okay. Quite a little monster Fontaine's dug up. When she does speak, which is almost a never, her accent is thick and grating. Her hair is filthy and she seems to wear the same mustard stained jumper day after day. But I've got to hand it to Frank. Tenenbaum is the old timer diamond in the rough. No training, no experience, but put her in front of a gene sequence and she's more sad than the hub she caught. I had thought that I had Okay, I guess I did get it. No, I did not get everything. Give me all that. Okay. Let's see. Let's buy some machine gun rounds. Okay, now we can carry on. Uh. Oh my god. That's it, kid. You're busto. My new friends will catch up with you soon. Uh, kid. Uh, make it quick. This is not good at all. I am out of money. Alright, I'm just gonna run it. I don't think fighting is really the best idea right now. Oh shit, hello. Oh my god. Run! Go, motherfucker! Let's go. Let's go. Where am I going? I don't know where I'm going. Help me. Okay. Now he's on my side. For now. I missed. Damn it. I guess I should fight my way through this, but that is a lot of people. Okay, at least it starts me here. I didn't see that Vita Chamber, so I might be able to do this. Um, take care of that. Missed again. There we go. Okay. Um. I need to try to get that big daddy on my side for now, and then later. It's just a bad corner. Bro, he's dead. Come on. Help me kill these guys, and then unfortunately I'll have to kill you. Oh, there's a weapon upgrade thing too. Great. Camera. I don't see it. The, am I blind? I know what your tiger's looking for. 
Where's that camera? Okay, I think I'm blind. What the fuck is a Whatever. Let's see here. Uh, grenade launcher damage increase. Two fully upgraded weapons. There you are. Damn it, I don't know where the camera's at. I'm connected to panicking too much. And I'm up to you. And you. I missed. Missed again. She did. Yeah, get him. That might be for later. No health. I have to hack it to get first aid kits. You know what? Fuck it. We'll use an auto hack. Okay. Where? There it is. God. Now we're in a good enough spot that I can take him out. Sorry. I know. I know it's friendly, and I'm sorry. Damn, they do a lot of damage. But I want to... I need more apps, honestly. I want to get more upgrades. Especially since Fontaine is taking all my health. What is that? You can hurt me. Oh, I Who's there? Oh man, telekinesis is really fun. You can run, but we'll find you. Except, well, it's fun when you actually. <laughs> It's fun when you can actually catch the grenades. Unlike that. Okay. Anyway. Actually, uh. Mr. Coswell? You don't know what it's like! Just, are you dead? Are you not. Wait. Where did you he go? Care. You're gonna run! How are you not dead yet? My god. Take you, little guy, aren't you? Okay, now let's make sure this Big Daddy actually has their little sister with them. Do you? Do you know what I'm up to? Because I don't think you do. Sometimes it works. That's really frustrating. My other plasmids, usually if I switch immediately and switch over, they work. Telekinesis did not. Maybe I'm just making an excuse because I suck, but... That's dumb. I'm sorry. Died several times for no fucking reason at all. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Please. Forgive me. Out of it today. Definitely out of it. 
Eh, I honestly shouldn't be focusing on the big daddy, but I really want the little sisters. I really want that Adam. So we're gonna get it, even if it takes us forever. We will get it. Do you have your little sister? Speed is literally the death of me every time. Uh, okay. Um, no, no trap bolts. I have a shit ton of trap bolts, but we'll do steel tip. Are you dead? All right. Jeez, that took way too much, too many resources. Every aspect of man except his character. Perhaps there is a plasmid that can grow the spirit. Perhaps in your DNA, the secret life. I sent a little one with some goodies to help ease your burden. Okay. So they sent her with some goodies. I don't remember where the last gatherer's garden is, though. So I guess we're just going to hold off until we find a new one. Because I don't know where... I'm not sure where it is. Sadly. Uh... Oh, uh... I know running is stupid. I really do. But damn it, I'm running out of I'm running out of resources. Looks like things have gone busto between Fontaine and his little German bean hole. Why a guy like Fontaine would waste his time with that spooky crowd when he could be getting the gravy from any dish he chooses is beyond the understanding of this paparazzi. Even reset the door code to five seven four four. Wait. This? 5744? Four? Oh, well, hot damn. If they can save one life, it's to save the world entire. I made a place for the children here. But this is you who are their savior. Will you stop here? Or will you deliver them from this terrible city at long last? Interesting, so I can just straight up go to the home of Frank Fontaine. Um, that's not what I want to do yet, because I'm pretty sure that leads to the final area. I'm not sure if I can go even do anything with them yet. But, I don't want to go in there yet. I think that was Tinnabom's kind of, uh, warning that, hey, you're kind of passing the point of no return, so if you want to free the other little sisters. Oh, it was right here the whole time. You're not ex getting shocked. Good lord. I mean, 
thank you. I didn't even mean to have the bugs, but they actually ended up helping me. something. Somebody? There we go. That. Always secret when with Su Chang, always secret. He must have this lot 192 in his lab near Apollo Square. I once stole a dose and brought it back to my flat on the second floor. I never knew what lot 192 was for, but if Su Chang was doing something in secret, on this I keep my eye. Okay, so now we need to get the lot 192 remedy. Um, oh my god. Oh boy, that was a bad idea. I was hoping maybe that would uh, help me get through all of them. But, um, I think we will go ahead and end this video here, and next time we will head into the Apollo station and get the Lot 192. We are nearing the end of this game. We shouldn't have much left, maybe a couple hours. So thank you all for watching. Um, we will see you next time, and we will progress more toward the ending of this game. Bye-bye.